Well, good morning, Killer Bee Nation. It's a beautiful morning here in Sierra Vista, and we have an unusual one, although it's the 1st of February. Actually, the 3rd of February. Can I get you talking about what you're doing here? Yes. All right. This, you, see, you see my new best friends. Who are you? We are Enchanted Land of Dreams, and we're working on the cinema and the roller rink here in Sierra Vista. Right on. And so uh, I get a call from this lovely lady, and she says, we're working back here, but the boys found a uh, like an ottoman thing with bees in it. Oh, God. And so, so wisely, she scared everyone else. <laughs> and so they're all gone. Nobody's here. And so we just arrived, and we're going to uh, make it safe so they can keep up on the cleanup. On They're really doing a really, really cool thing here. You're going to have a drive-in and a roller rink for kids. And, uh -huh. and I mean, this is so cool what you're doing back here. And this just basically well, vacant land. We appreciate land. it. And also, there's a lot of houses over here, so I'm sure the owners will yeah. appreciate the fact that we're, uh, we're oh, killing yeah. these bees. Oh, and what, what we always say, what we always tell people is if your neighbor has bees, you have bees. That's Period. True. Because they don't know fences and boundaries. Mm -hmm. And we've had them chase that truck for four miles. Oh, wow. After a bad removal. So, all right, so uh, Superman here is going to put on his bee suit, Killer Bee Nation, and we're going to take care of this. We're going to make quick work of it, and then we're going to take it back to the ranch and open it up and see what the hell's going on in there. And we're going to have you sit in your truck. And I'm going to sit in your truck. <laughs> you can back it up and watch, though. Just keep the window up. So, okay, guys, so they're over here. Uh, so there's, or, there's, already bees, there's already bees up on the comb checking us out. They're already knowing that yeah, they're already knowing we're here. So, so and... Of course, Daniel, Superman too. Uh, he's all ready to go. So uh, I got to get my bee suit on. So. Okay, Killer Bee Nation, we got some mean bees. Oh yeah, I barely touched it, and five of them came off right away. Oh shit! Did you hear that? Daniel barely touched the leg on the ottoman. See if we can unscrew him so we can get it in the bag easier. And five came out to check him out. Now, it's nice and cool this morning. It's 3rd of February. It's not cold. It's not even freezing. But it's nice and cool. So, I got to get my gloves on and shit. And, uh, yeah, make... We're going to get into this and get it done. So, we're back here. This used to be a homeless encampment. But, um... They're going to turn it into a, like I said, a skate park for the kids. And, uh, roller skating. And, um... A drive-in theater. Well, in these times of pandemic and all that shit, did you know that? They're turning this into a drive-in theater. I've been saying that'd be a genius idea since COVID started. What a great idea. Drive-in theater. I can see B movies. <laughs> what? Okay. All right, so now I am actually going to have her back up her... The bullion screw? Yeah. Okay, excellent. I'm going to have her back up the truck. You want to back up your truck a little? Back up the truck a little? Yeah, so you can see us better? Yes. Okay, and roll your windows up. Your back window and whatnot. Is it not? Oh, thank you. <laughs> yeah, no shit. <laughs> you got to roll up all your windows when you're doing this. Or they will find a way in. So Daniel is, they're already coming out to him. Oh. Am I zipped up good? Oh my God, they're angry as shit. Yeah. Am I zipped up good? Yep. 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 Everything okay, you look good, good too. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, these guys are not going to be nice. Um, oh, yeah. These guys are mean. These guys are mean, all right. So we're going to see if we can get these legs unscrewed without them being too mean. But these guys are really... Now, we are kind of in the middle of nowhere here. we got garbage and trash that these guys are cleaning up, thank God. But these bees are not going to be nice. Do you think we can fit this into a bag without the legs on it? Uh, yeah. Are they gonna? These legs are not really. These bees are meaner than shit. These, these, these bees are mean. Holy shit. Holy crap, they're all on my ass. Yeah, they're on my ass. Yeah, that's crazy. I'm gonna make sure I'm zipped up good. Holy shit. Yeah, this is a full big ass bee job. Even though it's what, uh, 40 degrees out? Yeah, something like 40 degrees, and these guys are on me big time. They don't like me at all. I mean, they're just hanging on, even though it's cold, trying to sting through the net. 
And I got one more off. Let me show. What Daniel's got going on there is just twisting off the cloth, which maybe we should cut the cloth, huh? Better than cutting the cheese. What? Look at all that comb. There we go. And there it is. So, that is a pretty good hive of mean ass bees, and we have no idea how much this thing weighs. Not too bad. So this time of year, everybody, out in Killer Bee Nation land, it is the 1st of February. Look at how mean these things are for winter, huh? Isn't that amazing? They don't usually have this many gardens, or these, you know, this angry of bees in the winter. These are all killer bees, so. Um, very little honey, because where they store the honey is their pantry, okay? And they have been eating through it all winter long. So this time of year, we rarely get much honey. They're waiting for the first uh, flowers to come out so they can replenish their source. So, um, we're going to see, are we going to have to cut that, I'm sure? Um, it looks like it's going to be wide enough, actually. God, I hope that all these bees are on the outside of my net. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so, um, kind of interesting filming, and uh, it might be wide enough. Put that out of the way. Maybe lift up, I'll lift up one corner. So these bees, even though it's winter, I don't think it's going to go, is it? Here, let's stand it up, actually. So, yeah, this way we can see if we can get this to go over it. Is it not going to fit? No, it's not going to fit. All right, well, why don't we slice two of them down the middle and uh, no wrap it that way. Wow, look at that beautiful honeycomb. And this is pretty light, actually. I'm going to bring it out in the... If this was full of honey in the fall, I wouldn't be lifting it like this. But it's not. So there is all that comb. Look at that, huh? Yeah, a winter hive just waiting to kill somebody. All right, Daniel? Just waiting to kill somebody. So Daniel's going to cut up. We haven't even used any spray adhesive on this because we are kind of out in the middle of nowhere, actually. And uh, even though we're right in town, it's an abandoned area, and uh, we're... We thought we were going to make quick work of it, but our bags aren't big enough, so these guys don't like me very much. All right. Let's see if we can do a front and a back, maybe? So what do you think about a once around with a tape or... We should have another uh, tape in there somewhere. All right, so just the beginning of the season here. Not even, really. And uh, we're already getting some calls, miscellaneous stuff, like this one where the people are doing some work or trying to. And so uh, we have no idea what to expect year to year as far as season straight activity goes. But I'm sure as hell going to find out. So, no. Making this as safe as possible, even though it's winter. All right, so we uh, have succeeded in getting the ottoman all packaged up just like a Christmas present from hell and put in the back of the killer bee truck. All right, so now we're going to tell her that we're going to be backing out to a safer place. I guess we can go out back out near the entrance, huh? Let's go back up, back out that way, and I'll, I'll back up a little bit, and we'll go back out toward the entrance and uh, tell this wonderful lady what the hell happened. Just crack it a little bit. Can you hear me? All right, right on. Oh, well, you saw it. We did it. Went really smooth. He's gonna back out. I'll back, and then pull out, and then we'll meet. We'll talk to you up front. So we did it. Yay! Yay! 
<laughs> I'm excited. I'm, I'll be happy, and everyone around the neighbors should be happy too. Oh, and, like way, yeah. like way, because these things are so dangerous. Well, you know. yeah, it's closer to the houses. We don't want anybody to get stung over there in that neighborhood. No, so. no, 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 no. These things are downright evil, and if anybody that works outside at all around here, like you said, once yep. the guys saw it, they were like, "Ah, nah, we're out of oh, here. Yes. Screw that shit." <laughs> No, that's right. So anyway, so we're going to settle up with this wonderful, wonderful lady. It's so nice to meet All you. All right. Well, thank you guys Absolutely. so much for coming out. We appreciate Absolutely. you. Absolutely. This will, uh, all this Killer Bee Nation knows will be up on YouTube. And uh, go to killerbeeguy.com. Buy some shit, would you please? Okay, bye. <laughs>